tingshas. Tingshas are the chimes. They're not really chimes, but they're the sounds you hear me ring in many of these meditations where I strike them three times. What are tingshas? What do they mean? There's some symbolism to them, and I'd like to share that with you. Find your meditation posture, sit tall or rest along on your back. Take a few seconds to relax your shoulders. the hands rest heavily at your sides on your lap jaw unclenches soften your gaze and close your eyes tingshas awaken they initiate and they focus our attention allow us to wake up and acknowledge that something's about to happen. That's why I tend to ring them at the beginning of a meditation or before we enter into stillness and silence during meditation. They are struck three times to represent the three jewels of Buddhism. When struck, each time, they are inviting, reawakening the energies of community, truth, and compassion. The energy of community rests in our crown chakra in our mind. The energy of truth rests at the center of our throat in our throat chakra. And the energy of compassion, of course, rests at the heart chakra. Before I strike the tingshas three times, I'd like you with your eyes closed, just to feel the energy around you, the temperature, the texture. Feel the energy inside of you. Your breath, your focus. And take this mental before photo of yourself and the room around you in this present moment. Now be still as you listen as I strike the tingshas three times. Notice any changes in the room around you and inside of you after the third strike. Take your after photo. Observe any changes in your environment and surroundings. Any changes inside of you. Community at the crown, truth at the throat, and compassion at the heart. These energies are now awake inside of you as you move back into the rest of your day. 
I'm thrilled to have shared this meditation with you and hope you find a more deeper connection to the Ting Shaws when you hear them next time in meditation. Peace and Namaste.